can't hear you because of the stupid alarm. Shut up! Hey! Knock it off! Okay, what? Hey guys, welcome to the front row. We are here again at Islands of Adventure to check out, whoop, whoop, there it is, the Velocicoaster. Lots of really cool stuff. Something huge happened yesterday that I wasn't here to be able to get, but let's take a look at this amazing progress. That building that is almost completely done. The Raptor transport cages are in right there. There's even more around when we go over to Jurassic Park, you'll see. And I don't know if you could hear them banging away back there, but they are definitely jackhammering or, or actually sounds like hammer driving some big screws or something in. That piece of track right there is brand new. It looks like the track is actually going to twist up and into that little transfer cage right there as the brake run. Man, they got so much done. And pick yourself home with dinosaur today. The rock work is looking absolutely fantastic and it's moving so fast. Up top there, they had ospreys nesting for a while. They put the blue tarp up to try to uh, deter the ospreys from building another le another nest. That was actually kind of ironic. The raptors built a nest on top of the raptor-themed roller coaster. I just thought that was ironic and funny. So did the rest of the internet. I'm just really late on it. Which a lot of people are predicting the other side. I just think that you're going to have to come in front of the Discovery Center and go in there. That's, where I, that's why I think they're building this court over. It's going, to be it's going to be interesting to see. I wonder if they're going to widen that path over on the other side of the Discovery Center to do that. Yeah, that pretty much does it for Velocicoaster today. Not too much, but the stuff they, that I saw was crazy. They really moved forward in a lot of those buildings. But stick around. Go over to Universal Studios, ride a few things, check out some treats, enjoy some, some 
Horror Nights Foods. I'll see you guys on the other side. Over on the other side. Oh, we spent some money I couldn't resist. It looks so cool. Beetlejuice hat. Cool hat. Can I see Shrek? I want to see Shrek. Horror Nights. And I got my lanyard. I got my lanyard. Because I don't like money. What's up? How you doing? I, you know what I do like? Beetlejuice. All right, we are sitting in Louise. I'm gonna try this crepe we got. I got the uh, chicken and arugula and goat cheese. They, off camera wife, off camera child, they brought me Louise because four annual pass holders here at Louise, Horror Nights Pizza Fries available all day long. So they are gonna get that. So you'll see that after this. But first, got to get into this crepe, man. It smells fantastic. I cannot exp like so it smells so good. Mm. The crepe itself, not first bites like all crepe. The crepe itself is nice and thin, as it's supposed to be, crispy around the edges. Mm. You guys got covered up by a napkin for a second. That was really good. It was very good. Yeah, I'm good. It smells delicious. Very, very good. Recommend this one. Next time we'll try the brisket one. We also have a vegan sausage one. Maybe I'll try that one and see how there is. But the chicken and arugula one is very good. See, proof positive. Come to Louie's. You have to order on the app, and you have to be an annual pass holder. This is an annual pass holder item only. But they are here. And guys, I legitimately am having an emotional experience right now because I can smell Universal Studios pizza fries, and we're not at Horror Nights. I don't even know how to feel right now. I don't, I don't even know. I don't, stop pushing them towards me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, they're so good. But you know what else they are? Heartbreak. I'm gonna eat one. Hold on, I gotta get one with some good stuff on it. Oh. You ain't had Universal Studios pizza fries. You don't know what the hell you are missing. Thumbs up for the pizza fries. This is legitimately an emotional experience. Oh. Holy crap. Yeah, those crepes, man. Really, really good pizza fries. Good for my heart. But I will tell you one thing about my crepe. It was, once I get down kind of further into it, it was really messy. But I ain't, I ain't care. It was delicious. Absolutely delicious. Grab some napkins. You're going to need them. Very, very tasty. I just got off of the mummy. I don't know. 15, 20 minute wait with Express, but it's mainly because they're separating people by parties, separating by rows and stuff, doing the COVID thing. Not, not too bad, considering today's the first day in a while, I believe since they reopened that we've been able to use for Express, so super excited about that. It smells like pumpkins and apples and stuff in your mouth. So good. That's gonna do it for our day here at Universal. Super fun, super cool. We were trying to get into the tribute store to grab a couple of the sweeps off of the Horror Nights thing, but their uh, credit card machine was down. And I only have one dollar in cash in my wallet, so we couldn't do anything. But definitely next time, check out some of them sweets. But we're headed out. Remember, be kind to one another. The front row is always worth the wait.